Hello and welcome to this MSSC Tech Short. In today's Tech Short we will show how to insert a 12-digit UPC code into a template. Now, let's get started. Here's a diagram of a type A UPC code, commonly used for US consumer products. Let's take a closer look at its components. A standard UPC A barcode consists of 12 digits with four unique sections, a number system character, a five-digit manufacturer number, a five-digit item number, and a check digit. Our UPC A barcode also has guard bars. These are located at the beginning, middle, and end of the image. A barcode scanner sees these bars as the start and end of the barcode. This helps the scanner properly identify and read the code. In a UPCA code, center bars play a role in splitting the code into two halves. This center split helps the barcode scanners with interpreting the values accurately. Now that we have taken a brief tour of the UPCA barcode, let's focus on the check digit feature. When using the UPCA barcode format, it's crucial to note, despite generating a 12-digit code, you'll only be entering 11 of the 12 digits into your template. The 12th digit will be generated by an algorithm. For a fully functional UPCA barcode, your format must be inserted correctly for the checksum digit to work. Now, let's look at adding the 11 UPCA digits into a template. For this example I used an online calculator to determine what the checksum digit would be. The calculator determined that the checksum digit is 2. Please click here to add a barcode object to your layout. Select barcode. Click anywhere in the layout to place the barcode object. Now search for UPC by typing it into the search field. Once you have entered UPC into the search field, use the check mark to move on. Find UPCA in the list and select that barcode style. Click the space below text to edit the numbers for this UPC code. This is where you will enter your 11 digits and the 12th will be generated by the software using the UPCA algorithm. As we saw with the UPC checksum calculator our last digit should be generated as a 2 when we return to the layout. That's it. Now you know how to insert a 12-digit UPCA barcode into a layout on the SmartJet 1 controller. Thank you for joining us today, and as always, happy printing from MSSC.